Send me your submissions, I'll rate your gameplay. If you take a bus and you get F's all day, I really want to rate gameplay with you. Please like and subscribe for your boy. Subscribe for your boy. Yeah! Okay, people, I'm a, like a little bit nervous right now, if I'm being honest. Because we have the return of Andy Nomis. Now, if you're not familiar with the series, Andy Nomis last appeared in episode 96, and he produced, in my opinion, the greatest Super Auto Pets run of all time. It blew people's minds. Uh, it like caused a whole series of YouTubers to copy what he did. Genius, I'm not gonna spoil it, link in description. And now he's returned. Like he sort of just lurks in the shadows. You just, you never, Andy, like, he doesn't check in with you regularly, but you know he's cooking up something disgusting, filthy, and now he returns. Unprompted, just rocked up. Hey Rev, I'm back, and here's what he said. Tactics, B+, creativity, A, dominance, B+, rounds 10 to 14 were horrible. Difficulty, S. The following activity is very time consuming and it should not be attempted by those watching. The gameplay is being performed by a professional. All pets were hurt during the shooting. What the hell does that even mean, man? So he doesn't have audio. I'll chuck in some music in the background. And you can see he's on the current weekly pack, which I haven't, wait, let me show you. Let me, I've watched the first 10 seconds. Look at what he does here. He highlights Sea Serpent. He highlights a Sea Serpent. He's like, phew, phew. he's crossing it. So we know we're locking in on Sea Serpent. And I uploaded my, uh, earlier this week, I uploaded a Sea Serpent video in customs before I realized that Sea Serpent was dominating this weekly, Sags uploaded a Sea Serpent video, Habs has uploaded a Sea Serpent video, it's the week of the Sea Serpent! And look, it, it's a busted thing, so... Uh, there's varieties I know you can do in this weekly pack with like a 1-up Sea Serpent, amalgam Amalgamation, that's what Sag did, like... Uh, he's saying difficulty S, which tells me like maybe it's that but it's different. And look, strap in people, 14 minutes. What better place to be than an Andy Nomis run, 15 minutes of it? Uh, it? Put your phone on Do Not Disturb. Tell your significant other that uh, the more important business to attend to has arrived. And uh, did my wife hear that? I hope not. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we've got the classic five pet, five health start from Andy. And he gets away with it. So is hummingbird like a part of your plans or are you just trying to save lives like the fray where did i go wrong i lost a friend you know that one puppy or poopy as some some people uh, call it now you need to skip this and you do now andy you are playing the rounds on slow speed but look uh, the more time i get to spend with andy Thomas, the better you're planning on buffing no you're not okay buffy uh man, <laughs> puppy excuse me Second position, Hedgehog. Are you Hedgehogging just for draws? Prof Ninja would approve. I don't know, like, uh, maybe I should have looked at the pack more <laughs> before speculating. Because I, I haven't played a single uh, game on this current weekly. I've just watched uh, Sag's video and Haps' video, and that's it. I'm just gonna like quickly, you know, I'm gonna, for the sake of the quality of the video, I'm gonna pause and I'll be back real quick. Okay, I'm so totally back. I just went and looked at the weekly pack and was like, doing like, I feel like I'm pretty strong at looking at a pack and finding some like, uh, hidden synergy. I just looked at it for like a minute. I'm like, the only synergy I see is like the obvious rock or Slepnia into Sea Serpent. And then the sort of advanced thing is what Haps and Sag did with the one up and the, Amalgamation and the thing in the thing. Like what, Andy? What? What? We? Yeah, you know things and such. Oh hell no! <laughs> no, 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 no. You're going to use the Flame ninety six, aka the fur bearing trout. That was Flame's nickname in high school. Are you going to be using the Rambutan to gain your mana? It seems absolutely insane. <sighs> okay, well, here's the thing. This could just be a total uh, red herring or a fur-bearing herring. 
Yep, in this in this sense, in this case. <laughs> Just shut up, Rev, watch the run. Um Cali Greyhound, that fits a mana of things and such. Freeze roll the trout, take the trout. And you have entered Operation Draw Build. Population Andy Nomus. Yep. You probably just draw like a whole bunch, right? Yep. Okay, so <laughs> it seems like the, the end game teams are quite strong in this weekly, right? You get your amalgamation. No! Okay, so straight away we have deviated from the path of Sag and Haps. Your meat boning and micro uh, meat. God, I went through this. Oh, it's happening again. What's the name of the meat thing? Meat tray? Meat... Meat... Oh, this happened in a recent episode. Rev, use your brain. Rev... Me, no, not Rev. Meat... Um... Wall chicken! By the way, uh, it's my birthday today, so no bullying in the comments. Uh, I'm, I get away with anything. You know, it's birthday Andy Nomus now that I recognize it. The ultimate birthday gift. My wife got me a cake. Your pangolin pilling. Are you keeping this microbe? Why are you buffing it so much? Now you're scaring me, dude. You're buffing the microbe. And you don't want more than a level 2 flame 96. The, the furberry trout. It's a compliment in Bulgaria, I've been uh, assured. Now this looks like a loss, but I think... The weakness plus the mana snipes is a lot to deal with. Case in point right there, you've maintained five lives. I'm guessing this is a dream run, Andy Nomus. Now you strawberry to get rid of the wall chicken weakness. Rev is familiar with sap terminology, the, the people have said. Seagull. Okay. Seagull gets Rambutan. Continually feeds sea serpents. Rambutan? Is that, is that where we're going? There is no way you can get that over the line against the absolutely busted late game teams. Yep. Okay, so you feel like you need scaling on your front unit. That would make sense. It's turn 10. Sea Serpent available in shop next round. You're saying no to Mana Hound. You're saying no to a variety of like the easy mana paths. I mean, case in point right here. Slepnir, Rock, and uh, Thunderbird. And yet you're going to win. Yeah, weakness plus Mana Snipes. It, 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 it gets results. Okay, now we see maybe the plan level. No. Freeze roll the chocolate. And you want mongoose next round. You keep freeze rolling. I guess you just need your sea serpent. <laughs> Andy, you're freaking me out, dude. <laughs> you should be... <laughs> Oh, wait, okay. Uh, <laughs> no, th at the start, when you crossed over the Sea Serpent, you were saying, I will not be taking... Like, everyone else is using it, but I'm not. Okay, Rev... Uh, when people say... When people say, is Rev GT slow? Uh, you can say, um, whoops, he's about uh, 11 rounds slow. Uh, <laughs> you, do, you do lose your first life, but look... You made it to turn 11. Still have four hearts left now. So what's your... You are, so you're saying no to Sea Serpent, but you're saying yes to Slepnir. And I think you're going to level it here. You indeed are. And once again, you're turning down the Sea Serpent. Oh, man, all of my um, postulating and uh, uh, considering of things is for nothing. Nice Wildebeest would be a shame if it got Mana Snipe. You don't get there. Okay, three health. Are you using a microbe in place? 
It's my birthday. No one's allowed to get mad at me. Cornucopia? Rejected. I will admit, my first thought was perhaps you're thinking a little bit of cornucopia. A little bit, eh? <laughs> a little bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, but you're not doing that. You will get a lot of stats here. You front the puma. I, ju I just remembered you said rounds 10 to 14 were rough. So really, I should have seen this. I'm guessing you're going to lose this round and next round. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, look, it's just another classic correct prediction from Rev. Add that, add that to the, the list and things. Okay, what do you sell for this? Yeah, yeah, Puma, goodbye. So your plan is... Let me try to think this through. Everyone else is just doing Sea Serpent, Sea Serpent, Sea, sea Serpent. It's like whoever wins the race to the Sea Serpent, plus an Ayala or so, probably wins. You say, I reject this, and instead I'm going to give everything weakness, and then I'm going to clean up your team with the Flame 96 Furbearing Trout. Am I correct? Wait, Pelican? Oh, there goes my whole bloody speculation. Jesus! Alright, so we're swallowing... Ah, oh, I can't deal with this. Let's see. Nice one-ups. Okay, 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 okay. We're going slow motion for this. Rev, turn your brain on. 0.25% speed. Pelican swallows. At this at this rate, it only swallows microbe. Everything gets weakness. Goodbye to your one-ups. Slepnia goes crazy. It's given mana to the fur-bearing trout. Which, which everything dies. Nurse Shark has nothing to snipe. Out pops microbe. And you win. Okay, this is psychotic, man. This is actually psychotic. So you're swallowing your whole team start a battle with the Pelican. Which gives weakness to everything. And fur-bearing Trouts to your back two units. You're also going to do something with this Seagull. Now you have a level two Pelican. So you... <laughs> Slepnir should give... Mana to your second and third units? It does. Swallow, swallow, weakness. Ah, oh, it's just so many snipes, dude. <coughs> and you draw. Uh, how did you even think of this, man? <laughs> how do you do it? How do you do it? You know how I always say Grounded Sap sits in a lab somewhere, like, formulating the most absurd things, like, wall to wall, there's strings, and there's labels, and there's pictures? Andy Nomas, uh, might have a similar type of lab. But he's not a content creator, so he's not labored by the need to upload. And he bides his time. Wait, so those mana snipes... Can we slow it down again? The mana snipes from the Slepnir trigger. Right? We'll go half speed for this one. Slepnia, Microbe, and Thingy have Mana Snipes. And they do trigger. So you get a Snipe from the... Oh my god, Tongue Twister. You get a Snipe from the Slepnia. You get a Snipe from the... <laughs> uh, Pelican. Then you get Snipes when the Salmon come in. But the seagull, the seagull confuses me because it's just getting weakness, no? Is this seagull doing anything? No, not currently. Okay, <laughs> so I think I have my, my bearings on this build and I think I, I sort of know what's going on. My, my only remaining question is what is the seagull here to do? And you want to level it still. Am I missing the seagull functionality? Rev isn't making any jokes. Rev is very locked in right now. What do you want on this seagull? You're turning down Mushroom? Okay, here we have like somewhat of a normie team. Swallow, Mana Snipes. <coughs> Why didn't the... <laughs> yes, ordering my friends, weakness, then the Rambutan, 
And then the salmons that pop out will get Rambu done. Flame 96's high school is up in arms. Okay, I get it. I see the I see the complete build. This is absolutely insane. And now you're gonna level this, and now you're swallowing three things. And if you can get the seagull to level three, it's going to give three flame 96s. Wow, this is this is just ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Here we have a normie team. Swallow, swallow, swallow. Rambutan me. More snipes. More snipes. Now you all get flame 96s. Holy bloody smokes. And you win. Okay, this is this is this is disgusting. This is disgusting. This is disgusting. How did you think of this? I wonder if it was an attack order issue earlier, like the interaction between the Flame 96 and the Pelican. I wonder if that's what caused you issues. Okay, unfortunately you only get to swallow two. But there go the mana snipes. Doesn't even matter that you die, you get to nine wins. I guess this team, like, a lot of things beat it, but it's, like, wildly kind of cool. Okay, you want... Does that one-up do anything for you? You one-up Pelican. Okay, I guess if it gets... Are there starter battle snipes in this pack? Let's see. Once again, your thing is... Your front unit is killed. Swallow, swallow. Rambutan goes back. Bang, mana snipes. So we get we get three or four mana snipes before we even get to the salmons, which then have mana snipes. Oh! <laughs> oh, excuse me. God, that must have been... You must be on the edge of your seat, Andy, or wherever your uh, preferred location of playing is. Honestly, it should be a throne, based on what we're seeing. Cornucopia. It's a good, it's a good pizza. Now, a level two mantis rip does ruin our hopes and dreams. Were you unable to... I can't be bothered figuring it out, but were you not able to front your microbe? Let's see. Uh, it's another... another... Nyal and Earthshark team? This time you survive. Okay, we, we get to see the action in full. Let's go. Swallow, swallow, swallow. So we're gonna get two 11 mana snipes that go. There goes the weakness. Back comes the Rambutan. Mana snipe, mana snipe. Now the battle begins. Buff back to the back unit. 14 mana! Oh, because you already had 11, did you? Question mark. You already had 11. Good. Okay, so now it's 14. You're going to wipe something. You hit Nurse Shark, which is going to kill your seagull. So we don't get to see the synergy. However, here come the three <laughs> salmons. Front unit is level three. And you wipe his team. Andy, you are genuinely one of a kind. You really are. You're a quality over quantity type of uh, player. I hope that my commentary was able to do it justice. And now I write. I'm pretty sure your last run was just A plus for everything. <clears throat> and people have said in the comments lately that I'm too kind with my ratings. Put yourself in my shoes, what are you gonna do? Tactics. You know what, this is how we're gonna do it, all four categories. A plus, A plus. A plus, A plus, I don't care, that's an A plus run. Did any of you think of that? And if you did think of it, were you psychotic enough to make it happen? Insane, man, I feel very good about A plus ratings. Andy, uh, I know that I've alluded to this and I sort of just said it directly then. You are an absolute gem. Super Auto Pets is lucky to have you. And I hope that from a viewer perspective, you enjoyed spending 20 minutes with Andy Numbers. Show him some love in the comments. Uh, I guess we await your next submission, which could be in uh, one month, two months, three years. Whenever it is, we'll be ready. Thank you, Andy. Goodbye, everyone.